Pokemon scam warning. One of these booster boxes is fake. The one on the left is real and the one on the right is not. It's missing the official set logo on the display flap for one and the print quality on the box is not so great. On the side, these packs are in sideways and upside down on the fake box. They should always be like the one here on the left. The tops look fairly similar, except the real box has a cutout on the display fold. The other one does not. The packs feel very, very loose. There's too much room in there. On the back, there's not a lot of text like there should be. And look at the crimp. The super jagged cut pattern is a very tall tale sign that this pack is not real. Inside, let's open this up. First, the font is definitely different. On this Hitmonlee, which actually is the real artwork from the set, the attack fonts are not as bold as they should be. Here it is compared to a real card. The cards also feel very plasticky, and if you really, really wanted to test a card that's a little sus, you can do the rip test. When you rip a fake card, the white part of the rip does not include a black ink layer like it should. Let's try it on a real card. Let's rip this Seviper in honor of the snakes we're trying to bring down. Black line in the middle, right there. This was a real card. No ink line, it's fake. 